Okay, hey, what's up? Just wanted to do a quick review and show you some nifty things you can do on your Evo without rooting it, you know, just in case you're scared of breaking it or whatever. Before I start this, just to prove that this isn't a ROM or anything, I'm going to show you the build number and firmware. First, um, there's the model number. Software information, Android version 2.2. Build number. Software. And so forth. Sorry about the camera quality. I'm recording this from a Samsung moment. <laughs> so, yeah. But, on to the point of the video here. I'm running the LG Optimus One Home Launcher. And I'm going to sh you know, show you that in a couple of the widgets here. First, um, let's take a look at the uh, calendar widget here. There, this is the first one. This is the month view. Of course, it has little buttons here to change the next month, so forth. You can click on the day if there was an event there. Then here's the second one. It shows the day view, which there's no event. Today is Monday, October 18th. You go to the next day to the 19th. And if you did have an event, there's a nifty little button right here. You can go back to what today is. It takes you right back to the 18th, which is pretty sweet. Then there's also this nifty memo widget that LG has. And if you just click on here, pulls up text field. Hi. I like Android. So sorry I'm doing this with one hand. <laughs> but um then you can also add a picture. You can add one from your gallery or take a new one. So let's just take a quick picture of this click here. So then you will click done. And then it lets you crop it. Okay. And you save. And there it is. And then you save the memo. And it's right there on your home screen. Okay. Hi, I like Android. There's a picture of a click. Motorola click. There's the date and time it was taken. You can always go back and view it. See how it pops up. It pans out, but it's still on your home screen. And you can um you know edit it. And you can edit the text field or you can click the picture and ask you to replace or remove. Okay. Removed it. Save. Then here's the little minimize button. It goes back down. Okay. okay, now on to the home launcher as you see. The app launcher button looks different, and there's a, a dock down there at the bottom. And see, since this is a Evo, I still have um, HTC Peep right there. Hmm. Here's an app for um, App Inventor and Mozilla Firefox and such. So. You open that up, and it's just like the Optimus one. Uh, your app drawer is broken down into four categories. First one being communication. You have your Gmail, Messages, and Google Talk. You have your multimedia. You have Gallery and YouTube. And all your applications that were stock that came stock on the phone. Like I said, since this is the Evo, it still has 
you know, the the desk clock, the flashlight, FM radio, footprints, fringe stream, and all that that came stock on here. You know, NASCAR, and Quick Office, and Sprint TV, and Sprint Zone, all that stuff. But then there's another section for downloads, which is all the apps you downloaded you know, after you receive the phone. And these are, you know, So they added that in for your app drawer, which is pretty sweet. It's different. So, and of course, you know, the dock works, press Firefox. This is the test build that they have on their website. Anyone can download this. Well, if you have like one gigahertz processor on your phone, and Android 2.0 and up. Yeah, see, so just show you the dock works that it's not an illusion. Also, when you press menu, they have another thing for your home settings. And you have your home selector, and you can set your number of screens from 5 to 7. Go ahead and do that. See? Now, at the top, you can see there's more 7 dots now. There's more home screens. So, it's pretty sweet. Also, the other thing that you'll notice here is a different gallery, which is the 3D gallery from the Nexus One. It's pretty awesome too. Oops. Um, you know, comes up just like that. I don't really want you to view my photos. Let me go to a different photo real quick. See, as you can see, um, see up here it has all the little things like it does on the Nexus one. So, let me go ahead and just show you real quick. 3D gallery. Hmm. Just like the Nexus one. So, those are some pretty nifty ways to go ahead and add some modifications to your Evo if you don't want to root it or anything. Nice to see. All right, thanks for checking me out. Good luck. You can uh, download all these straight from the market, like I said. Um, show you real quick. Download. See? LG Home Gallery. And they're all from Rayman50. I'll put his name in the description. He didn't, of course, make these. He just uploaded the APK. But from Rayman... 50. They're all there in the market for everyone to enjoy. So have fun. Good luck. See you next time.